everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to God of War Ragnarok. Damn, look at this. Is that frozen lightning? Yep. Want a closer look? No. Frozen lightning, Jesus. And this was a bit more than a cold snap. Maybe I can... Ah! Would you just let me do it? All right, after you. So what was your plan anyway? Just stroll up to the old Valkyrie Council Circle and hope Freya's in a good mood? Well, now that I know where she is, yeah. Exactly what I'm gonna do. Fuck. <laughs> Don't tell Brock I cursed. He's unbearable when he's smug. Look, Balder tried to kill her. We had no choice. I'm not sure she sees it that way. Well, I'm not gonna ask her. Besides, they were your arrows. You're absolutely right, which is exactly why I'm recommending we don't do this. Right, he's not coming down. We might do later. Nice. Well, that's quite enough excitement for one day. No way. We're so close. Oh, I can destroy those as well. Oh, letting the others okay. go first. Taking up after your dad after all. Maybe this is a sign. Don't be a baby. I'll catch you. Promise not to drop you this time. Hi. Fine. Just step between the realms then. You know it doesn't work that way. Though sweet Bessel, I wish it did. <gasps> See? Was that so bad? I sincerely hope I never have to do it again, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> My shop! Well, if I can't stop you, then this is as far as I go. I'm gonna stay and fix this. Suit yourself. Fair enough. Ah. Alright, shop's not open, so I can't do anything with that yet. I don't think I can break this. I need to find another way around. You sure you want to go in there wearing the very arrow tip that killed her son? I'll hide it under my shirt. And besides, it's a reminder to be better. You need a murder weapon to be a better person? It makes me feel brave, okay? Is that such a bad thing? When it leads you to believe you can convince Freya of anything, yes, it is. I have to try. Hit the fire car. Please. Just keep going. Ah. 
Oh, it's not a climbing one. This is a good idea. You haven't got a plan. Rock says some people run better on chaos. I think he's right. What makes you think that applies here? This is life and death. And this is Ragnarok. We can't just do nothing and we're out of options. Living. Living is an option. <laughs> Which way to the council? As long as I go up and forward, I think I'll get there eventually. Yeah, sounds right. Ah, uh, you're an idiot, boy. You really are. I imagine Kratos is going to be too thrilled with this. No, can't do anything with that. Fair enough. Nicely done. All right, more sounds go. It's blocked. You need to destroy the sonic piece first. All right. I just need to get a different angle on the sound stick. There we go. That was easy. He'd be pretty. Yeah. I wouldn't have to hide things if he'd just trust me. How can I trust you if you lie? Actually, that's a good point. Yeah. It is a good point. Maybe if you listen to me, could I not say the same? Well, where do you think I learned it from? Stubborn kid. <sighs> Nicely done. Keep going up. Wonder what mom would do. Why don't you trust her? Why won't you tell me? Oh, 
not that way. Ah, here we go. Oh dear, hello. There we go. Guess I'm going the right way. Really wish I had a compass. No, do you not have one? Anything around here to collect beforehand? No. Just to make sure. I don't have anything to break you with. Is there something hanging up anywhere? No. Much farther now. Just need to look out for that big door. This is a really dumb move, Atreus. I'm just gonna say it. Sindri's right. This is beyond dumb. Is that 
You up there? Hello down there. Hey! Come to your senses yet? Yes. I mean, uh, I'm not changing my mind. Ha! You do have doubts. <gasps> hey! Like you never do? Better than having regrets. I'm not sure I agree with that. But by all means, keep going, and you might find those, too. <laughs> I had an option there. I'm not sure I picked the right one. That's the door. Just be sure to scream if she starts killing you. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. You probably avoid mentioning that. Yeah, that's... Is that Freya? Why am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh... I'm so dead. Yeah! Dumbass! Uh, Counts of the Valkyries. Who oh, she is there? Freya! You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What makes you think I won't do the same? Your son was a psycho, love. You're better than this. Ah, uh, shit. You would stake your life on it. <clears throat> what do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, save your breath. His fate is sealed. But you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin, nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us, offered peace if we don't move against him. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Groa's prophecy, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. <laughs> Jotunheim. We learn the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin. And he's already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Okay. Okay. 
what we found here. Maybe if you spoke to him. Tears alive? Yeah. We we broke him out of Sword of Farm. Impossible. The nine realms are closed to all. No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all band together. Enough. Enough! <laughs> Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. All right, Ivy. Ooh, she all made. Oh, convenient. Here's Temple Fusers, uh, Sandstone echoing the warrior's spirit. Ooh, cool. Okay, so I'm not dead. I didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. You think? I will never, ever admit this injury. Thing I like climbing. Yeah. Oh, thank Amir. You're all right. How did it go? I'm starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it. But I don't think she's going to help us. Uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... Hey! I just fixed that! <laughs> yup! <laughs> I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Okay. What secrets are you keeping, Sindri? Damn, look at this place. Nothing, nothing to talk about currently? Ever quit. Ow. 
Ow. Ow. Oh, could you knock that shit off? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. What? I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. Isn't it? Is that going to be like a side quest? We help Brock get the rest of his soul back? Head back. Don't know what we can here for now, I think. Really? Now? Whoa! The hell is that? Good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. What do you mean? A choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well... You can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. <laughs> oh. a, a nickname he has for you. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Shall we? We shall. I hate coming home empty-handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to... Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there... I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. Oh, this is not going to be good. Go, go, go. That is not the risk that concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? 
I trust their wisdom, and this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the Giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peeing? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. <laughs> this sausage uh sure why not i remember food tasting better <sighs> i suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot i accept what <sighs> atreus who are planning our next move oh so where are we going? Alfheim. Home of the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are seeking information. The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Do better than the seer who saw everything. I wasn't sure you, um... Never mind. That's great. I'll find. Hey! Don't go forgetting this what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> <laughs> More for me. Oh, that was very awkward. Tyr, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. Oh, right, it was waiting for me to move. So, where did this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we set to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of our talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. Ah, that's nice. And on that note, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I'll be sick later. This has been God of War Ragnarok, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.